Hi, Jenna. <laughs> Geminis. This is Genevieve with Belladonna Moonbeams. How are y'all doing? I'm doing well. Um, I'm actually doing better since I started doing this. I mean, I was just okay. But since I've been reading, I've seen just so many positive things as I've been doing these readings tonight. I'm just kind of happy about that. So, um, the first thing I get for y'all is the Eight of Swords. This card says you feel all bound up and like things are out of your control. But, well, let's turn it over. But you've got these swords around here protecting you. So even though you're be feeling bound up, you're being protected by spirit. Okay. The next card, we, but it's toned down. So you've still got, you're protected by spirit, but um, you're not really as trapped as you think you are. The next card we get is an upside down nine of cups. And this is all about success. You're going to get everything you want. But once again, it's toned down, which I believe is because you feel trapped. So you're feeling trapped. So that's going to keep you from appreciating your success. And then you've got the fool once again, toned down. And the fool is, he's getting ready to start his journey. He's going, la, 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 la. The world is great. He's not seeing things. See, his dog is even down there going, no, don't fall off the cliff. But he's actually getting ready to start this great journey. So you're going to have some great things going on in your life. But <clears throat> I, I think that you're feeling trapped by them. Um, the first card I get in Oracle cards is the clear quartz. And this card is all about feeling your emotions. It's time for you to let your emotions be real. Like many of us, we've hidden them for so long. And that, I believe, is why you're feeling trapped. Because you've not been letting yourself feel those emotions. And so you're trapped by them. You're being held so tightly by them. But if you let go of them, you're going to achieve everything you want to achieve. This next card is sensitive emotions, which is saying that they're right there under the surface and you just haven't been letting them out. You've been, they're just riding underneath and you're really sensitive right now and that's okay. But you've got people in your life and you can let those emotions out. The next card is amber, which says to give it to God. Now, amber is not really a stone. It is a, I forgot what it's called. Oh. Anyway, um, it's a resin. Um, and it's beautiful, and it's kind of a golden color when it's polished. If it's not polished, it's kind of an um, orangish color, but it's still a very beautiful and powerful um, resin. Whoopsie. Um, this says to give it to spirit, to the God, to goddess. And the next card is to value your self-worth. That means that you have value. You may not be feeling it because you're all trapped. You're so trapped by your own emotions that you're not realizing how much value and power you have in your own life. You're not trapped. You're only trapped in a room of your own making. I see a mushroom. Mushrooms can either mean a magical powers, which it could be, or it can mean rapid growth. This is going to be a week of rapid growth for you, Geminis. Um, maybe you don't want it, but you're going to get it. And I see a happy face. So with this rapid growth, you're, ha I'm, you're going, it's going to be good. There's a happy face there. It's saying that this is what spirit wants for you, and you will be glad when you get to the other side.
and I see a ribbon. Um, and ribbons mean winning. So you're going to win. You're going to win at this. That's what this card says. You're going to win. And I see it, a crescent moon, which is two, is all about winning. Gemini, this is going to be, there's going to be some stretching you this week. And you don't like that. That's why you're feeling all trapped and um, like you don't want to start on this journey. You're like, no, 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 don't want to go. Don't want to learn. Don't want to be the best me I can be. But Gemini, trust. Trust in your own wisdom. Let your growth occur. Um, we're all in this weird, crazy time of COVID, and we've all been being stretched in so many different ways. So this week, Gemini, just trust that you've got this. If you want to do a private reading, send me a text at 405-512-9400, or send me a private message on Belladonna Moonbeams. If not, I'll see you next week. And... Let's grow.